Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new to my channel, hi, my name is Jessie. And finally, today's video, we are going to discuss about the Morphe Jaclyn Hill palette. I know that it has been a month and a week since I have this palette. And the reason why it took me a long time is because I told you guys that I wanted more and more experience with this palette. So after using this for a month and a week, I can definitely let you guys know what I truly feel about the palette. I have used this multiple times as much as I can. And if you guys are interested about my thoughts on this palette, then definitely keep on watching. So this is $38. You can either buy it on the Morphe website. And in my case, I got this one at Ulta. And this is what the box packaging looks like. So this is more of like the revamp version. Let me just read what it says here in the back. It says, creating this palette has truly been a dream come true for me. Morphe gave me a full creative control and allowed me to customize my dream palette for everyone to enjoy. Every shade was customized by me, and I really hope you guys love it as much as I do. I wanted a range of neutrals and pops of colors to accommodate all skin tones. I put my heart and soul into this palette, and la 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 la. <laughs> XO Jacqueline. So, you have 12 months to play with this baby right here. Has her picture in the back. And now, when you open the palette, I mean, when you open the box, it has a bubble wrap, which protects the palette, which is really nice. And this is the actual packaging. So the first packaging is actually not shiny. And it doesn't have anything like this in the back where everything is labeled. I think it's pretty nice. And these are all your eyeshadows. This is definitely my type of palette because I love warm colors. Don't get me wrong or anything like that. I'm actually not a Jaclyn Hill fan. I don't even watch her videos. I just love the color, you know, the colors in this palette. It's the reason why I bought it. So let's move on to the swatches. So if you guys wanted live swatches, I have a video dedicated to that one. And this is just to save some of your precious time, okay? But if you guys wanted to watch the live swatches, I'll definitely put the link down below. But everything here is just one swipe, no base, and this is what it looks like. Here are some of the looks that I have created using the palette. I'm not even kidding when I told you guys that I've tried to use it as much as I can. Almost seriously, like every time I go to work, just to have the full experience of this palette. So I have been playing with this palette ever since I got it. So that's like a month and a week. So now I'm going to create a look for you guys so you guys could see how these eyeshadows perform. I have already put a primer and I have set my whole eye area with a loose powder. And then using the shade Silk Cream, I am going to apply that on my crease. This is going to be my transition shade. By the way, ignore my brows. I am not done with them yet, so sure. -er. And then after that, I'm going to use the shade Hunt and intensify my crease actually i'm gonna do like a halo eye makeup look today it always ends up like that and i'm gonna do like all matte eye makeup look today it's been a while since i have done all matte and then after that i am going to grab the shade chip and then i am going to intensify my halo eye makeup look seriously i love this color i love it it's so Hmm, do you guys know the lipstick sin from MAC? It looks like that to me. So I really wanted to have this really nice, dark, vampy look. What? And then I'm going to pick up this, the shade Jack Z. And that is the color that I am going to put on my entire lid. Then I'm just going to create a winged eyeliner. And 
And after that, I am going to tight line my eyes. I also wanted to add a black eyeliner on my lower waterline. And then I'm going to grab the color Hunts and put that on my lower eye. Lower eye. Under eye. <laughs> and then of course it's not going to be a sassy makeup look without my whore lashes. And this is the eye makeup look that I have created today using the Jaclyn Hill palette. To tell you guys honestly, I have truly enjoyed this palette probably because all of the colors is something that I personally like. But if you are going to ask me if I feel like the formula of this one is different from the other Morphe palettes, I do not think so. <laughs> palette I know that it costs a little bit more than the other regular Morphe palettes but to me spending a little bit and not getting the exact same shade in this palette is definitely worth it for me like it's not like it's a super expensive palette you know what I mean I do understand where it is coming from but to me having all of these shades with the price is worth it and you can also use your points and a coupon if you do have one and I think it's such an amazing deal so Again, I'm just only one person opinion. I'm not going to say that it's the best palette in the entire planet. Definitely not. But I find it reasonable. And I find the colors amazing. And I love how it works on my eyes. So thank you all so much for watching. And if you like this video, do not forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you are still not part of the Sassy family, don't forget to subscribe. I upload almost every day. So just turn your post notifications on. I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye.